Today's Ninja Life Hack Story is called Frustrated Ninja, written by Mary Nin and illustrated by Jelena Stupa. Let's go and see how Frustrated Ninja calms his frustration down. Even though I followed the directions, my slime was too runny. I could have gotten frustrated, but instead... I stayed calm and spoke positively to myself. I can do this! I've learned to recognise the hot feeling of frustration and put the flames out. For example, when I don't understand how to do something, I ask for help. During school, when I ask to do something and my teacher tells me no, I calmly tell myself, it will be okay. When I lose or make a mistake, I take a deep breath and count to ten. I used to not know what to do when I got frustrated. I would just react. Each time I got frustrated, I could feel my muscles tighten up, I would start to feel hot inside, and sometimes I would have trouble thinking. Then I would start to feel out of control. My muscles would tighten, my thinking would get blurred, I'd feel hot sensations and fast heartbeat. In the past, when I was asked to put away my electronics, I got so frustrated I would say unkind words. If I made a mistake, I threw myself on the floor, kicked my feet and screamed. You forgot to say Uno. And whenever someone didn't want to play or hang out with me, I would push or throw things. But things changed one day when I lost a game. I got so frustrated throwing my controller across the room, it barely missed Impulsive Ninja. I felt bad I acted that way and went to find my friend. I'm sorry, I don't know why I did that. It's okay to feel frustrated, it's normal. But acting that way when we are upset won't solve any problems. And we might hurt ourselves. Or another person. It's just that I get so frustrated sometimes. I understand. Our frustration can resemble the flames of a fire. The bigger our frustration gets, the bigger the flames and our reactions become. When our frustration is smaller, we might react by screaming. This diagram shows you how our reactions get bigger, just as flames do. You scream, then you throw yourself on the floor and kick your feet, say unkind words, push or throw things, and then you might even hit people. But there is something we can do about our frustration. We can start to feel frustrated. Remember to be like a firefighter and calm down the frustration flames before they turn into a big fire. To calm down the frustration flames, we can use some of the tools firefighters use to put out frustration flames. Talk about our feelings. Think about a funny or happy memory. Ask an adult for help. Go outside for a walk and tap into our five senses. Count to ten. Stop and take a deep breath. Write down our worries and problems in a journal. Listen to music, colour or journal. Squeeze a pillow, toy or play-doh. The next day I tried to be aware of the feelings I had including any frustration. Several times throughout the day, I recognised that hot feeling of frustration and immediately pretended I was a firefighter putting out hot flames. Mom, I'm getting frustrated. Can you help me make this slime? I was able to better manage my frustration from then on. 
I continue to pretend I'm a firefighter by calming down the frustration flames when I get hot. Frustrated Ninja's Poem When I get hot, it's my body's communication. That's what I'm feeling is frustration. I choose to stop and put the fire out because calm is what I'm all about. Fight hot feelings of frustration by calming down the flames before they become a big fire. Don't forget to subscribe.